Good morning. We're here with the artist Tony Fitzpatrick. His exhibition is here. This is your alma mater, right? The College yeah, of DuPage? Yeah, I, I, I studied uh, painting and drawing and theater here. I love what you say about here, that they always told you you could do it, and you could do yeah. it all. No one ever said, no, you will, you will no, never make money no. doing this. There was a marvelous director of uh, College of DuPage at the time named uh, Dr. Hal Mackinich. And he'd kind of hang around the lounges and talk to the students. And we, we didn't know he was running the whole thing. Mm -hmm. he, we just thought he was an older guy doing continuing education. Mm -hmm. And I said to him, you know, I don't know whether I want to be an actor or an artist. And he goes, well, he goes, you know, kid, it's not binary. You can do both, you know, and let one thing kind of inform the other. And I want to talk about this painting. Tell me about this work of art. This is a... Uh, this is about the first time I ever heard a record by Miles Davis called Kind of Blue. And this happened in your brain? <laughs> you know, it, it, was, it, it began to happen in my mm -hmm. brain. It, mm -hmm. um, it, it struck me that he was doing uh, in music what I'd hoped to do as an artist. I mean, I knew there were gonna be birds in this, and then mm -hmm. the rest of the way I just kind of improvised. And if you've ever heard Miles Davis, mm -hmm. you understand that instinct. Um, and it, it added a great deal to my work. Perfect. When we come back, we'll have more with Tony Fitzpatrick, Jesus of Western Avenue, around town from the Cleve Carney Museum.